loosen up. You guys ever wear, you wear a hoodie and then the hood, it hangs back there. And if it's warm at all, it just like that part of your back gets sweaty. The fuck's up with that? Hi, happy every hour. Holy shit. Can you believe it's July? Yeah, I know you can. Because it's been July for a little while now. Alright, this week, we are drinking. <laughs> I'm a little concerned about this. I'm going to be honest with you. Let me show you. For bam Liquid rain, liquid rain. Liquid Rain is a collaboration between Wellbeing Brewing and Four Hands Brewing, and it's delicious. It's true. This particular one, this is the last of a six pack that I had, and I'm trying to remember, I'm almost positive, this is the one that uh, kind of exploded. Every one that I opened, it was too carbonated. Um, I've seen that happen with every brewery, even in my high octane days. But this is a, it's nice because it's El Dorado hops, it's an IPA, and it's tasty. But is it overcarbonated? Let's find out. Should I get a towel? I'm going to hold my hand over it. Maybe I'll do a slow open. So far, so good. So far, so good. This is the test. This glass may be half head. I'm just disappointing you guys because everything I'm saying, well, we'll see. I'm so excited right now. I haven't had a good liquid rain in a while. <laughs> Yay! So, spoiler, I already know that I enjoy this beer. There, now we're centered. I'm obsessed with being centered on the camera. Check it out again. <laughs> Liquid rain. You can see over here. Well-being brewing, four hands brewing. Ignore the fifth hand. That's mine. Let's try this. Liquid rain IPA brewed with El Dorado hops. Ooh, the, what the hell is that? The sweetness, there's a, there's a sweetness on the top. This is like the, uh, what did we just drink last, last, uh, last week? The Hazy AF from BrewDog. It's like a sweetness on the top. Oh, that's interesting. Gosh, now I don't know if I remember this correctly. It's delicious, but it's not its not what I thought it was. There's a... It's a certain thickness to it. And then... Can you have sweet hops? It's like a sweet hoppiness. That's interesting. Almost a little like saltiness in there too. This is uh, it's hitting a lot of different zones on my tongue. If you know what I mean. This beer is a collaborative effort to break the silence around mental health in the craft beer industry. I wish I didn't say that with that tone. You know what's great? Well-being brewing does this they do these collaborations so not only is it with four hands brewing but it's also with things we don't say hope for the day a couple organizations and they put these little qr codes on there if you scan that you can get mental health resources uh, they did this with their tropical ipa wandering islands where you could scan that and get um, financial and mental health resources for restaurant workers uh, it's really great. Their collaborations are really, really great. They, you know, they put their philanthropy right out in front. Well-being brewing. Highly, re highly, highly recommend. Check them out. Uh, if you're not already 
a big fan of them, you will be, that's for sure. Um, you know what? I thought I had a card over there. Um, if you go wellbeingbrewing.com slash friend request, I think that's it, you'll save 10%. So go do that. Um, I don't think this is available anymore, but keep an eye out for it if it is, because it is delicious. And check out their other collaborations like Wandering Islands. Um, I'm a big fan of their Intentional IPA, which is right over there in my fridge. It's just like one of my go-to IPAs and it's in a big old 16 ounce can. I need to stop talking because we're talking about liquid rain right now. Okay. <sighs> Delightful. And we reach 